Yeah. Food and life is such a beautiful thing. Don't you think? <laughs> oh, if you guys are enjoying this content, don't forget to subscribe here, like this content, click on the bell, be a part of the notification. Bang. I'm gonna say this, this is my first time ever trying Harvey's guys. And I'm not even joking guys. So I got the double Angus burger with their onion rings, which looks bombs guys. And ketchup. This is the burger I got guys. So the double Angus burger, not thrown on garlic mayonnaise, pickles, onions, some goodness. I'm not gonna lie guys, that burger patty looks legit guys. Nice and fresh, lettuce and everything. What surprised me guys, I asked if these were a little extra for the cost. She said no, so that's definitely a bonus for me guys. Places like A&W would charge you extra for the onion rings. Guys, so pumped for this. First time ever trying Harvey's. Take the first bite of this. Quick time. You guys got it. Nice. I'm so pumped. <laughs> Let's do this. Mmm. This is a good burger. But let me tell you about this patty though. This patty, guys, does not taste like beef. It tastes like that fake beef. It looks good. No hate on the fake beef. I love fake beef. Mmm. But guys, this is the patty I always buy from Superstore. If you guys are Canadian, these are the <laughs> these are the President's Choice or the No Name Brand Burger. That's what it tastes like. If you guys look at the patty, it's definitely not a fresh burger patty or freshly ground burger. But I wanna say it's still all good. But, mm. my homie didn't hook me up with Napkins. <laughs> so all good. I always got leftover napkins. Let me say this. These burgers are very similar to Dairy Queen's burger. It's not fresh. Definitely frozen. Um, the ratio with the ratio between meat and I want to say soy protein. I want to say soy protein is higher than beef. I'm not gonna lie, guys. I was like expecting more from Harvey's. Like when I look at this patty, it just looks too perfect. Looks too perfect to be real, guys. Still an awesome patty. But if you look at it, there's some sort of agent that is pretty much binding the beef and soy together. I wanna say soy. Just because it does not have that beef texture. The seasoning is pretty much overpowering it or taking hold of it. The texture of this beef has a texture of Nam Nuang. <laughs> it has a texture of Nam Nuang. What we put in Nam Nung is pretty much Vietnamese sausage, so baking soda is added into this. That's why you get this weird rubbery texture on this. 
I was actually expecting more from Harvey's. More of a fresher burger. More like Five Guys, but a little better. But I was wrong. Still a tasty burger, not gonna lie. Holy. <laughs> ah. Still a good burger. They're on your rings. Take the first bite of this. Quick tab. Guys, got it. Nice. I can definitely tell this is frozen and not pre battered. My nose is still going to be all good. Mm hmm. That's a good onion ring. I like their approach on this. Looks like some fights going on. It's always drama, guys. It's always drama when it's four o'clock here. Traffic is just crazy. Guys, Mountain Dew, quick tab. Nice. It's a perfect onion ring, guys. Does it beat NW? In my opinion, no. I like NW onion rings better. But these come second. They come second in my fast food onion ring ratings. Mm -hmm. I'm still a little choked up about the burgers. It just looks so good. It legit looks so good when advertised, when I'm looking at it, when I'm holding it. But when I bit into it, I did not get that, that beef, you know, that beef textury taste to it. I'm a little saddened. <laughs> Harvey's. Why you gotta bring me down? <laughs> All right, my review on it. For me guys, for a burger to be an awesome burger, I must have the taste and texture of real Alberta beef. <laughs> I must get it, guys. I'm thinking right now, there's not a lot of fast food joints that does have this real beefy taste besides McDonald's. McDonald's has real beefy taste. Five Guys, Wendy's for sure. Wendy's for sure has an awesome beefy, textury taste and fat burgers. Yeah. I want to say this, Harvey's has something going on that is awesome, which you can put on fresh toppings and whatever toppings that you guys want. But um, besides all of that, when I bit into it, the burger wasn't as great. First thing that popped in my mind when I bit into the burger was 20K challenge was those burger patties I ate on my 20K challenge video. If you guys haven't checked it out, I'll leave the link in the description. Check it out. <laughs> I apologize to all my Harvey's lover. Hopefully you guys understand. The burger, maybe the burger patties in your country or your city is different from mine, or maybe this location is a little different. I'm not too sure, but the patty wasn't up to burger par standard for me, guys. It has to be meaty, but all in all, guys, still all okay. good. You guys enjoy this one. Don't forget to subscribe if you haven't. Also, don't forget to pick up one of your food and life's a beautiful thing shirts. Like this, share this. Peace out.